big as Xanadu, but the quality of player is the most important thing. Um, what was I going to say? All right. Oh, off to game one. Oh, pit. Electing to go pit. Okay. Triple's pit yeah. isn't bad, to be honest. It's not that bad. I, it's, I think his, his Sonic's still way better, but I know yeah. he, he doesn't is, really like this matchup. He's been playing Sonic for so Sonic. long. I mean, his name is True Blue for a reason. Why? Oh, because he's a printer. Because Sonic's color is, uh, like, the most blue-blue. I think it's, like, 255 blue. You know, when you go to, like, That was his brawl tag, actually. Yeah. That's funny. Anyway, so... I think um, that's what it is. Ape Man doing, you know, what he always does. He's what, his keeping his character, it, keeping his opponent out, and yeah. getting those nice follow-ups wow. every time he hits him. Oh, nice that's so actually that really cool. I think that's actually maybe a reason that True Blue's elected to go pit in this matchup. First of all, because Ape Man is so comfortable against Sonic. And then, secondly, oh, that was because me. he has a reflector. True. So he can, he has two reflectors, technically. Yeah, but that down B reflector has a ton of cooldown. Cool yeah, that so is true. Even if he reflects something, if Ape Man's in a position, he'll punish the reflector anyways. Yeah, but it's good if he's off stage. Uh, yeah, I agree. Like if he's lasered. not above the stage directly. So he can get under the edge and then up B and hopefully actually sweet spot it. <laughs> Ooh, and it looks like Beep Boop is not a combo anymore. No, not at this percent. Hits with pretty the light. Oh, that oh, should be a punish. Yeah, not a very really heavy one, though. Oh, uh, well, there's that kind of play. Oh, and he tried to grab that? That would have been really cool if he grabbed it. <laughs> you really have to respect that move, to be honest. Yeah, it's really good. But if you shield it, I don't remember the difference. I don't remember whose is whose, but I know dark pits and pits are different in that one. First of all, pits one. Will cross pits will cross you up. Oh, pits crosses you pits, up? Pits crosses and you up and dark pits stays okay. on the Oh, that should be a side. kill. Good up throw from a pit man. They also have different uh, knockbacks. Pits hits more vertically and dark pits hits horizontally. I'm surprised that... Oh, that was, that was deep. <laughs> You would think that if they strike to Smashville that uh, True Blue would choose Dark Pit. What's that? Just because of the boundaries. I know that Nairo, the, the premier Pit and Dark Pit player, yeah. elects to go Dark Pit on stages with smaller side boundaries. Interesting. Oh, wow. Didn't reflect. I guess it was too late into the move. Good grab. But center stage, so none of the throws will kill. I don't know if they kill anyways. Forward throw kills pretty, not super early, but it would kill if he got him on a regular getup at this percent. So he read the air dodge there, but didn't quite connect the punish. Ooh, air dodge oh, into, into ground. The ground. Oh, Ooh, and, and yep. Ape Man does not know how to punish that. <laughs> He's like, what? He just needs to grab in place. He needs to turn around and grab. Oh, right, right. And beep boop. It. Yeah, it's not going to... Yeah, not anymore. Rage really affects the... Now, you know what Ape Man... Uh, oh, my kill. God! Down smash almost killed. Oh. So what Ape Man could do now, if he wanted to be extremely stylish, is just jump off stage, SD, and then come back and get a Beep Boop. Because <laughs> it'll kill with no oh, rage. Oh, and yeah, it looks go. like True Blue does it for him. Combo. Yeah, Beep Boop will probably work now that Ape Man doesn't have any rage. Rage is such a dumb mechanic, uh, in my opinion. Yeah. But whatever. That's that's not uh, the conversation of the day. Ooh, these reflectors, oh, if, wow. if nothing else, are really funny see, to see. Yeah, because... While... Ape Man's patterns are not easy to, like, follow. Follow, unless mm -hmm. you've played them a lot. Mm -hmm. True Blue's played them enough to like kind of know his patterns. Or like, oh, that stage spiked. Yeah. I well, think it just hit him while he was staying. I didn't even know if he chose a get up. Yeah. It didn't oh, like oh, nice super armor, armor from True Blue. But he's gonna die to anything. Yeah. Up throws a kill. He literally just needs to be flicked and kill that. Good grab. That was such a ballsy oh. grab from True Blue. If Ape Man spot dodged that, that was a that dead was a pit. Super dead pit. What a ballsy grab. I respect that. Yeah. I like throwing that uh, gyro up so that so Ape Man, Ape Man can't, can't use. Oh, that was, that was really. Fun. Bounces up gyro with laser and it hits the balloon. So who gets that uh, countered for the balloon pop? I'd give it Ape Man. Yeah. I would say that was some mini golf with gyro. <laughs> wow, that was a really good uh, pivot, pivot up tilt. Up tilt. Yep. Yeah, Triple's doing a great job keeping, uh, keeping... Oh, is he going to die to that there? No. Oh, I like, I like that stay back. Oh, oh that's forwarder it. Will do it. And wow. I don't think I've seen Rob kill with forwarder before. Yeah, see, but all he had to do was flick him. Yeah, he literally he just literally flicked just him. He literally just had to flick him. Yep, he just flicked him. He is a psychic. Yeah. So, True Blue's, um, excuse me, Ape Man taking game one. Uh, pretty, like, True Blue's definitely bringing it back towards the end, but it yeah. looked like Ape Man had control throughout the majority of yeah, that Yeah, he match. had to lead the entire game. I didn't see True Blue get Pit is trouble. really any grabs. Like, he got a few grabs. He got that grab True near Blue? the end that was, like, really His dangerous. His grabs were pretty good. And he got one grab from center stage, but I don't remember. 
He didn't do any grab follow ups, is the main point. Yeah, I don't know how Which many like has. I know at early percent. A percents. lot. It's like down throw, up smash at zero. Yeah, or forward. And air. probably even down throw, up smash after the first down throw, up smash on Rob. And then it's down throw fair or down throw upper. Right, yeah, I know. For a while, there, exactly. to like 70 probably. But after that, it's like really slow to build up the damage. Right. I mean, there you just, at, the, at that point, you just start reading air dodges. Triple is trying to figure out what color he wants to play. Looks yeah, like I think that's the, that was the more pick. important thing. Not the stage kind of pick, <laughs> but the color kind of pick. He's Sonic. He has to make everything take longer. Which is <laughs> ironic because it's got to go fast. Game two on Final D, I don't know if I agree with this counter pick from True Blue. Uh, I mean, FD is such a good stage for characters who are so projectile based. Especially Rob. He's going to have all this room to run away I think and shoot things. The only better choices would have either been to run it back, because that game was pretty close, and he definitely was bringing it back at the end. Mm -hmm. Or maybe Battlefield. Or Battlefield, yeah, that's what I was yeah. going to say. Or even Dreamland, honestly. I don't know. Dreamland has a pretty low ceiling. It has FD ceiling. Does it? Yeah, I think it so. It feels like it has a super low ceiling. But maybe that's just like, because you don't stay in the bubble for very long. Maybe right. it just has like a naturally high regular ceiling, and then you like barely stay in the bubble. Interesting uh, shield pressure with that pair. I feel like that can't be safe on shield, but maybe it is. Triple doing a very good job this game, though. Yeah, he actually has He's been spacing out uh, Aikman very well. This wow, that was a really good nice. Nice, yeah. And up smash might kill? Nah, nah okay. not yet. But up smash does kill pretty early. Wow, it just breaks the gyro. <laughs> it doesn't even... Oh, that's stock. Oh my god, oh, okay, just no. barely living. Huh, yeah. breaks gyro again. Oh, see, and that's why I like that stay back if you're off the stage. Yep, stay back. Because you just do it and fall, because... As long yeah, as Pit doesn't hit. like actually get knocked out of the boundaries, you can up B from pretty much anywhere. Yeah, yeah, definitely. So, oh, back here. Okay, at this point, a forward throw will kill. Oh, really? Up smash. Okay. Yeah. I know up smash definitely will. So Maybe not from across stage, but right, right. But from center stage, probably even at this point. Wow. Going that was deep. his last jump. And now Ape Man's playing the keep away game. Yeah. Nair, Which is interesting high. that uh, True Blue is the one who has to approach in this situation because he that is was actually a really, really good down B. Yeah, it really was. There. Blocking the entirety of that boop. I feel like he's really. F oh, forward throw! See? Yeah, there you go. Forward throw kills. There it is. <laughs> wow, he just, just picked picks that up right up. Gyro, yeah. <laughs> oh, is no, he going to run away with it? Oh, no. Oh, uh, he should have thrown it up. Yeah, I agree. Arrows are a little too slow to camp. Yeah. Down throw up here, yeah. It's just the eye dependent. Yep. But normally it's down throw up there. Oh, he whiffed that grab, that was really close. Yeah, let's see, the eye away. There. Good jab. I don't really know how Pit plays the neutral, but I guess it's a Pit lot of grabbing and jabbing and if you're not Just close. having good range in general. Yeah. His sword is deceptively long. That forward smash, oh, and huh. there's the stay back. Imagine if that hit Ape Man. That would have been. That would have done a lot of damage. I don't know if it actually multiplies the damage at all, but. I have no idea. But at I the mean, very every least. Every other does, so. Yeah. Look at all this wow. extra credit True Blue's gotten. Ape yeah. Man out at 86%. True Blue's. And smash will probably kill at this point. With Max Rage, yeah, maybe. Yeah. I think down throw, just run up, charge up smash. Will work. I have a, like a gut feeling that that's going to work. The hard reads. Oh, and Ooh. there. I don't know if that multiplied or not. If it did, it wasn't very much of that. Scene. Oh, Ape Man just yeah. grabbed him. Yep. And he exploded. Okay, Ape Man can definitely bring this back, but Beep Boop's not going to work for very long just because of rage. Yeah. So, yeah. Oh, but he's getting so much damage with that gyro. Oh, it huh. still hit. I that guess is. it doesn't change ownership. That's weird. I guess Pit's not very Ooh. good against gyro. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That has a hitbox on the actual, like... On Rob's actual face. The neutral Ooh, Ape Man bring really this bring this so back. He hasn't hard. taken any damage. He hasn't gotten hit yet. Yeah. Down throw and up smash? Yeah. Oh it. my god, and Ape Man takes that it. That was super that clutch. Stock, it, that may as well have been a zero to death. <laughs> yeah. Like, Ape Man didn't get hit a single time that whole Ape stock. Ape Man laughing, Carl. That was insane. Trying to come up with some excuse. <laughs> Carl's like, yeah, that happened. <laughs> Something I was talking about with Tito earlier when it was. Uh, Ape Man versus Silence, I think.